Hi there, today we are looking at these few rolls of filament from Colorfab. So let's get started. So just saw in the time lapse, the first print is this small dog. It's printed in Woodville PLA on a 2.2 kilogram roll of filament. The dog came out really nicely and is based on a model from Joseph Prussia. You can find a link in the description below. We have not just one, but we have actually two of them. And both came out really great. There is a bit of stringing at the back side here, but that is really, really tiny. On the side you can find full resolution photos of this model. Besides cutting their Woodville PLA, I also got a few of their normal PLA PHA. So let's have a look at the few prints. First of all, we have a low poly Pikachu from Floralistic. It's printed in the dual color model on the Ultimaker 3. The model came out really nice and because it's partly transparent, you can see here at the sides a bit of color blending. That's actually not uh, actually blending, but more the transparency in the print. Of course, such small Pokemon is not like so you also have a very big sized Pokemon. This came out great as well. As you can see, the print has a bit of bleeding here at the side as well, and you can also see some of the infill. This is caused by the transparency of the print. It came out really nicely, and you nearly can't see any lion lines at all. It was printed on the Ultimaker 3 as well, with 150 microns. As with the dock, there are some high quality pictures on the side, so you can see the print result yourself. So, both prints came out really great. Both the small dock from Joseph Prussia, printed on the original Prussia i3 MK2, as the Pikachu from Floralistic, printed on the Ultimaker 3. You can see both that they are really great, printed, and with really all great details. The filament prints really well out of the box, you don't need to do any special settings. You just follow the temperature settings on the raw and you get there. Um, so that's it for this video, hopefully see you soon. If you are not subscribed yet, please subscribe.